Hi again, Patrick here. When the museum installed its latest temporary exhibition, African American Art in the 20th Century, Joseph Delaney's Penn Station at Wartime immediately captured my attention. I was drawn to the history that's depicted in the scene from the architectural elements to the fashion of the travelers. As the title suggests, there's also a subtle hint of military history with the American flags hanging from the vaulted ceilings to the MPs watching over the crowd. And it should also be noted that Delaney finished his painting in 1943 as America was in the midst of its involvement in World War II. So, with that in mind, please join me as we continue our talk about African American history, this time in addition to some World War II history. One of the 1.2 million black Americans to serve during the World War was Private George Watson, who was drafted in 1942 at the age of 28. Watson was assigned to the Army's 29th Quartermaster Regiment and served on the transport ship Jacob, where he worked in logistics. On March 8, 1943, the Jacob was near Porlock Harbor, New Guinea, when it was the target of a devastating surprise Japanese bombing attack. The attack was unrelenting, forcing the abandonment of the ship. As enemy fire rained down, Watson's first and only inclination was the safety of his fellow servicemen. Instead of seeking safety himself, Watson swam back and forth, back and forth, back and forth, repeatedly dragging injured, unconscious, helpless soldiers to the safety of a life raft. Watson did this to the point of exhaustion. So fatigued from his effort, Watson couldn't escape the suction of the sinking ship and he himself was pulled beneath the seas. His body was never recovered. Watson's selfless courage saved many soldiers that day. For his act, Watson was awarded the Distinguished Service Cross. He was the first black serviceman to receive that honor in World War II. But that's not the end of Watson's story. The Medal of Honor is the highest military distinction awarded to an individual serving in the armed services. Since its creation during the Civil War, over 3,500 Medals of Honor have been bestowed to soldiers showing extraordinary acts of valor. 89 black servicemen have been awarded this distinction, though it should be noted that not one Medal of Honor was awarded to a black soldier during or immediately following World War I until 1991. Following an investigation started in 1992 into whether there was racial bias in the way Medals of Honor were awarded during World War II, it was concluded that racial undertones prevented proper recognition of the acts of valor from black soldiers. In 1996, Congress passed legislation allowing President William J. Clinton to award the distinction to deserving servicemen. The following year, 1997, Clinton, in a special ceremony, bestowed the Medal of Honor to seven black servicemen who served in the Second World War. One of those soldiers, Private George Watson. In addition to the Medal of Honor and the Distinguished Service Cross, Watson was awarded a Purple Heart. Additionally, in 1997, the United States Navy named a cargo ship in honor of Private Watson. I hope you enjoyed today's video. Until next time, be safe, be kind, and good luck.